When you walk into John Powell's office, you'll see a lot of military memorabilia, each somehow connected to his Navy career, and each has a story. He's collected a lot of memories over 20 years and fulfilled a lifelong dream along the way, as he shares with us in this Veterans Voices. I could tread water a lot longer than I could hold my breath, so I went to surface ships. From the start of his military career, John Powell knew how he wanted it to go. When the Air Force wanted him to work on electronics, he decided on the Navy, first becoming an aircraft aviation bosun mate. I was attached to a helicopter carrier, so I had I worked with helicopters. Um, but you have rotors, big helicopters turning. You're trying to land a helicopter, and you have feet between the aircraft that you're landing and the aircraft that's on the deck in front of you. Powell's service at sea started on the USS Nassau. It was on his second tour with the ship that he trained in law enforcement. Military men and women do not enter the gates and take their horns off and put their halos on. So there's bad guys no matter where you go. Powell says aircraft carriers with 5,000 people on board are like a small city, but instead of a police car to patrol, he had to walk. He worked anti-terrorism in all kinds of cases, but recalls one night in Lisbon when he responded after a riot. There was three ships in port, and they arrested 800 people. We had to go up to the uh, police station and pick them up and start hauling them back. So then I woke up to find that uh, my picture was on the front page of just about every paper. While in the Navy, Powell also went to Arson Investigator School, which was a lifelong dream. You're out there. That's it. You, you, there, there is no help. You, you, you're 911. You're, you're the help. Um, and if, you know, you, you got to fight to save it. And was a witness to history as part of the commissioning crew of the USS George Washington. And all the crew is off the ship, and they'll pass the word to man the ship. And the entire crew runs aboard the ship. So my job during that one was I was on. Uh, um, I stood next to and stood guard for. Um, Barbara Bush. Powell finished the last years of his career as the chief of police at a naval base. 20 years in the Navy, I spent 14 on ships. After not intending to make the Navy his career, Powell retired as a chief petty officer, a rank he says it was an honor to achieve. It's one of the most memorable events of my life. I can tell you that now. I'm proud of that. Always will be. After military retirement, Powell worked for a sheriff's department, the Naval Academy, and eventually on the detail for a previous Secretary of Veterans Affairs. He's also very involved in the American Legion as a past commander of Post One in Wheeling and a department commander for West Virginia.